good afternoon, Hoffa Bay High School. I'm Jessa, and this is Cougar Campus News. Students, please continue to be patient with regards to your grades. First semester grades and report cards have now been finalized and will be mailed home this week. Attention all members of Big Biscayne. Please join us for our next meeting at lunch tomorrow in Mr. Olson's room K-11. Please attend as we need to plan our SWAT giveaway. As a reminder, free math training with Jay and Leo continues this Wednesday after school in room G8. Stop by G8 at 345 if you need help in your math class. Now, here's Mr. Taylor with an important announcement about some P elective courses. Hey, Half Moon Bay High School students. If you're looking to sign up for an elective next year, look no further. In uh, physical education, we offer three different electives. One you're probably familiar with, Power and Strength. It's a great course if uh, you want to keep working out in the weight room, save that money on a gym membership, come to class each day, get a good workout in, hang out with your friends. It's a good time. Two other ones you might not know about. We also have dual and team sports. For those of you who love physical education, for the playing sports, getting out there on the field, playing hoops, all right, volleyball, softball, but you didn't like all the other stuff, this elective is for you. All we do is games, activities, sports, all the time. And our third elective is Unity PE. This is a new elective. It's gonna give you an opportunity to work with some of your classmates and help coach them and work with them towards their goals of participating in the Special Olympics. It's a really fun course. It looks great on college resumes, and there is opportunities for volunteer hours outside of the classroom. So if any of these electives sound like they'd be for you, we're going to be uh, meeting in the gym on Thursday, January 25th at lunch. That's Thursday, January 25th at lunch for your physical education electives. As a reminder, coming up next Monday, one week from today, during the lunch hour in room K11, it's the meeting about broadcasting, an elected class. If you're interested in taking broadcasting, which is an approved UC elective, hey, if you're college bound, it's a great class to take. You learn all about the, the history of broadcasting and you get to participate in the campus news. Join me next Monday at lunch in room K11. Hey Cougars, before today's sports news, wanted to remind you that this Thursday during lunch, it's going to be service jam, so don't miss it. Behind stellar team defense, the boys varsity basketball team jumped on Jefferson early and never looked back, cruising to a 71-45 victory. Asher Meehan filled up the stat sheet again, finishing with 26 points, 10 rebounds, 4 assists, and 4 steals. Raul Keshav scored 17 points, and Gavin Glenn played well as he chipped in 13 points, 5 assists, and 4 steals. The Cougars are now 4-0 in the Bay Power League. The boys soccer team had a tough loss to Burlingame on Friday night. The highlight was the lone goal scored by Giovanni Maldonado, who continued to be a dominant force on the field both offensively and defensively. The JV team was able to pull out a 1-0 win with Jack McMillan putting in the goal off a penalty kick. The varsity team plays today at 4.30 at home against Soquel in a non-league match. There will be an informational meeting for all interested in JV baseball this Wednesday in the weight room at the start of lunch.